Juliet is a doctor and works in the ER department of the hospital it means there is any emergency like accident etc she has to deal with all this, coming home tonight, she tried to sleep but could not sleep something has happened to her recently which we will get to know later in the movie, she looks for a new apartment for herself but this is New York there is a lot of space constraints and she was not getting the right apartment within her budget finally she got a call from one place. She went to see it there we see other main character whose name is Max, was doing innovation actually he is owner of this whole building, Juliet saw the house was very big so she feels that she will not be able to afford but its rent is very less, she asks Max why so little Max said that it is very hot here the structure of this building is of that type, underground trains also go from under the building because of this the whole building can vibrate. If the renovation of the entire building was going on then there may be trouble for a few days, Juliet tells Max that I should be the doctor of ER when she sleeps she takes very deep sleep she will not have any problem she has finalized this apartment, Max helps her to move Juliet's stuff while moving Juliet meets Max's grandfather he was very creepy type, ask her do you have any pets there is no pet allowed here. Julie says that no Juliet did not have any pet Evan grandfather does not like too much sound then this will not even Juliet after this strange meeting. Juliet moves into this house she finds very strange in the apartment at night as if someone is watching over her, this is her new apartment so maybe that's the reason thinking that she ignores it, when she came home the next day some gifts were kept in front of her door she thought that the gifts were given by Max, in one scene when she is back at work her friend invites her to go out. Juliet refuses for this her friend explains to her that he cheated on you because of this you don't need to be so disturbed, it means Juliet's Romeo cheated on her after being deceived, Juliet doubts herself she feels that she was not enough for him her friend said that he was a lousy man so there is no need to think so much about him, you should now move on when Juliet comes home she meets Max, as he thanked Max for giving him the gift Max says I have not gifted you these were actually given by the grandfather. Juliet then goes to say thank you to Grandpa. Grandpa falls alone so he wanted Juliet's company. Juliet says that I am a bit busy and left from there on one day Juliet went to the art gallery with her friend, obeying her friend while she collided with Max. Juliet asked Max can we walk till home Max loves being with her too both of them have talked about different things while walking actually Juliet's parents were drug addicts in such a condition, she took education and became a doctor. Max and Juliet were getting along well with each other, Juliet's ex saw all this his name is Jack on coming home, Juliet started kissing Max, Max just gets away Juliet gets a little embarrassed by this it's probably a bad idea, she is a tenant and if she has any relationship with the owner and something goes wrong then she will have to leave the house, at night when Juliet was taking a bath there is a hole in the bathtub someone was watching her from that hall. She felt someone near the window when she checked window was open but no one was there next day Max calls Juliet, saying we were a bit awkward yesterday today I make dinner for you, Juliet likes it at dinner, Juliet tells Max that because of you I feel like home in this building asked Max why you are not married till date, Max says I never had a serious relationship he always takes care of this building afterwards his grandfather. No one has ever met who can understand him after their dinner was over they were coming closer again, Juliet says it's a bad idea after closing the door she comes out again, Max was also waiting for her both of them go inside and start getting intimate suddenly Juliet started feeling a little uncomfortable in the bed, she says I was always with my ex I am used to him it is very difficult for her to do all this. Max also understood everything and leaves from here and after that we get to know about Max he knew Juliet for a long time one day when he went to the hospital with his grandfather he saw Juliet there, Juliet liked her very much he saw on the notice board that Juliet wanted an apartment that's why he called himself after seeing her was always keeping an eye on her this building is also a very old and strange building. Max can actually see Juliet's whole house from behind the wall we saw in the previous scene that someone was watching Juliet taking a bath it was none other than Max, Juliet always feels that there is someone in her house actually, Max enters her house keeps an eye on her while she is sleeping next day when Max was giving medicine to grandpa so grandfather says I know everything about you you two are spoiled like your father he was a weak man your mother was very beautiful but her decision turned out to be wrong just like your father you also passed the week, this conversation shows that what Max is doing to Juliet is the same thing he has done to other girls. 
His grandfather hit him for it perhaps Max's father also used to do similar things. Max suffers a lot from all these things next day he follows Juliet again after bumping into her at the wine shop pretending that their meeting is just a coincidence. Juliet apologizes to Max for last night she said that having a relationship between us is a wrong idea. Max also agrees in front of her but he is not going to leave her so easily tonight when Juliet was sleeping Max comes to her room and kisses her. Juliet wakes up after a while goes to the kitchen and notices, there is empty space the next day he told Max about it there was an extra room to keep wine and so on actually Max could have entered her house through this room, Juliet still doesn't know about it, to do the work of this room Max stays in this house all day and uses different things of Juliet he pleasing himself. Juliet's ex-boyfriend Jack has been trying to convince her for a long time messages her again today so Juliet was ready to meet him today is going to make dinner for him then came home with everything. Max's work was over now so he says I want to make dinner I can help you. Juliet refuses to do so Max says what is going on between us I don't understand you started the relationship between both of us. Juliet tells him that I told you that dating both of us is not a good idea. Max says if you were going to leave me then you should not have started after that he left from here when Juliet was not paying attention. Max again reached the apartment he checked all her mobile etc. He came to know about Jack he was in the apartment when Jack reached there. Jack has a small dog. Dog sees Max in the house and starts backing Max ran out of here quickly where Jack say sorry to Juliet he says without you I am ruined misses her very much. Juliet also tells him that I cannot be with anyone else these two then become intimate with each other. Jack had to get up early in the morning to went home then Juliet takes some wine after that she fainted actually. Max has always found drugs in Juliet's wines. That's why she never wakes up at night, can come to her and keep an eye on her he can do whatever he wants with her due to fainting every night. Juliet used to wake up a little late she was not even able to sleep so she got disturbed by this. She feels that there is something wrong with her house she has then installed hidden security cameras throughout her apartment if anything moves in the apartment, she will get a notification this camera also has night vision that is she will see everything even in the dark. Max didn't know anything about these cameras Max was fed up with taking care of his grandfather then one day he kills him by taking a drug overdose. Juliet and Jack started meeting each other regularly then seeing all this Max became very jealous. Max chases Jack he threw him down the stairs tonight Max came back to Juliet getting intimate with her then Juliet's eyes open this time he drugs her from the syringe next morning. Juliet was late again noticing the cover over the syringe in the bedroom. She suspects that she gives her blood and urine sample to the hospital to check where she comes to know that someone is doing drugs to her. Jack was about to go to her apartment today so Juliet calls him. She says please don't go there but Jack didn't pick up the call he was looking at everything in the apartment when he found a way this is the same way from where Max enters Juliet's apartment when Jack was watching all this. Max was behind him and what happened after that we will know later. Juliet hurried to her apartment looking for Jack then she checks the security footage of last night on her computer when she saw that Max had raped her last night she became very disturbed then Max entered the house can't show in front of him that she knows everything she became careful didn't want to show Max she knows everything. Max again brought in wine for Juliet this time he himself was drinking wine too when Juliet was looking disturbed he asks her. Juliet says that I am not getting enough sleep these days. Juliet wakes up and tries to call up and Max takes her phone he says why do you want to call him he cheated on you Max catches Juliet and asks to sit. Juliet was scared asks where is he? Max again with the syringe who tries to drug Juliet he could not do this successfully, Juliet had a knife in her hand with this she attacked Max, she tries to run away quickly but Max has locked the whole house due to the drug she could not sleep so she took different pills, Max comes inside the house again he catches her by the bed, hurriedly Juliet hits and hides in the bathroom there was also some sound coming from the mirror of the bathroom actually Max could see everything behind the mirror breaking the mirror drags Juliet inside, Juliet attacks Max with the mirror glass, in internal she running away from there, Max says you can't run away from here nobody can run away from here, Juliet saw all the things around then she got a nail puncher, Max doesn't see her anywhere Max catches her and knocks her down when he comes to her, Juliet punches nails in his body he was very much hurt but still follows her, 
Juliet ran into a store room while running that's where Jack's body is found when Jack found Max's way Max killed him. Max had reached Juliet again. This time Juliet finally kills him with many blows and the movie ends here. No matter how normal people are in appearance no one can know what is going on inside them. Subscribe for more videos like this, turn on notification, and leave a like to help the channel out. Thanks for watching.